Hello boys and girls, Miss Holloway here. This is lesson 11-2, vocabulary introduction. So I've already made a video and taught you the vocabulary words for 11-1 with a Kahoot. This lesson will also go with a Kahoot. So after watching this video, get on Kahoot and play the quiz. All right, so let's get into our vocabulary words. The first one for lesson two is called ray. Don't confuse this with a ray, it's just ray. And a ray is a part of a line that has one end point and extends infinitely in another direction. This picture is actually showing two rays put together at the same end point. So let me show you a picture of a ray. One end point and it extends infinitely in the opposite direction. So our motion for this is going to be fist on one end and your hand out in the other to show that one end has the end point and the other end goes on and on forever. The next word is called vertex. That is one, but vertices is more than one vertex. A vertex is a point of an angle, polygon, or solid where two or more line segments meet. Okay, so if I were to draw a triangle, the points where the sides meet would be the vertices, or one of them would be a vertex. Okay, the motion for this is going to be just here, 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 and here, kind of making like a rectangle. Vertex, 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 vertex. The next word is angle. And I talked a little bit about angles in the first lesson. But an angle is a figure made up by two rays that extend from the same point or line. So if I take two of these and put them together from the same end point, we make an angle. Now angles can be measured and we kind of go off of a straight um, angle that goes up and down and out to the side, which measures 90 degrees, which would be a right angle. A right angle is an angle with a measure of 90 degrees. So what that looks like goes straight up and down and then straight out to the side and it makes a square corner. If you can fit a square corner right there, then it measures 90 degrees. And you would measure it with a protractor, which I'll show you in our reteaching video. Okay, so our motion for right angle is going to be your arm straight up and your other arm out to the side, right angle. The next angle is an acute angle an angle with a measure of less than 90 degrees. It's open less than a right angle. So we would draw it, um, here would be your straight line, and then your other line can be anywhere, let's say here is our pretend right angle. It can be anywhere this way. So I can draw my other ray anywhere this way or less than 90 degrees and usually acute angles are small so when we talk about acute angles our motion is going to look more like this because this would be 90 so less than would be this way and we say a cute little angle and the last one is obtuse an obtuse angle is an angle greater than 90 degrees or more open than a 90 degree angle. Okay, so here is a 90 degree angle. Make my imaginary 90 degree angle. So then the angle would be open more this way. You would draw it coming out this way. So it's more than 90 degrees. And we call that an obtuse angle. So here's your 90 obtuse would be open wider and we say obtuse angle so right acute obtuse all right now go ahead and play kahoot <laughs> 